Hi City Tats family, uh, it's Artie Sanchez. Uh, gonna come up today with uh, Artie's top five kettlebell exercises which can be done at home. If you don't have a kettlebell, I'm happy that you use a dumbbell. If you can't get hold of a dumbbell, I'm happy that you use a water bottle. Okay? Now obviously the idea is to work the whole body in a short period of time. We're all time poor. Uh, as we get busier in the future. Uh, so we need to make our exercise time as effective and as beneficial as possible. So we're gonna give you top five exercises and we're gonna show you how to work the whole body so you can work off your winter coat. Okay, first one is a, what we call a kettlebell swing. It's very functional, uses every muscle in the body and will help you in everyday life. Okay, we're just using a 10 kilo kettlebell to start with. Okay, we need to start with the kettlebell at the base of our feet and we must use our legs. Everybody uses their arms and their lower back. No good. Okay, so in the other important uh, aspect is the breathing. If you breathe correctly, you will maximise the benefits. Okay? The critical aspects of that is because we start at the bottom uh, phase of the exercise movement, we need to blow out to start with, so we inhale on the way down. Where that exercise can go pear shaped or where you can hurt yourself, if you try to go too high and you arch your back. As you can see, I only went to shoulder height really thrust your glutes, your hips forward. It's a glute exercise. You want a Bondi bum before we go summer? Need this exercise. If you go too high, you will arch your back and damage your back. Okay, like I said, kettlebell, dumbbell, Okay, must exhale as you rise. That way you inhale as you come down and you'll engage your core. Again, everybody work to their limit. We can use a water bottle. Okay, my friends, that's number one. Number two is the same exercise, but it's what we call a progression. So it's gonna be with one arm and I'm gonna do it facing the camera this time. Just understand, don't go much higher than the shoulders. Do not arch your back. Again, the important, the critical, critical aspects of that exercise is again, not to arch your back. At the top of the movement, you must be perfectly straight. Not arch, not bent over, okay? That's exercise number two. So you would do five each hand, each arm, rest. 10 each arm, rest. Your third set, as many as you like. Okay, first two exercises done. Three exercises to go. Okay, unfortunately we're coming into winter we can all be guilty of eating too many comfort foods, so we need to work off our winter coat before we develop it. So, this is called Around the World. Now, I want some movement, bit of Latin love, bit of swing in the hips, dancing, okay? Okay, whole body. Around the world, we call this. Okay, so you go five one way, Bang, five the other way. Bang, must do both sides. Don't work your preferred side only, okay? We don't live in symmetry. This is a good exercise to correct our asymmetrical uh, posture, okay? That's exercise number three. So as you can see, okay, we're working the midriff, 
all our important core muscles, again, coordinating with our legs. Exercise number four. This is called figure eight. Okay, very difficult, a little bit difficult, but very achievable, and again, great for great functional exercise. Will help you in everyday life. When you've got to pick something up, you've got to twist, okay? Again, so use the legs. Down with the legs. Up with 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 the legs. Okay, so as you can see, functional. We're crunching our side abs, okay, our obliques. And as you can see, works up a sweat. Again, if you haven't got a kettlebell, we can use a dumbbell, okay? A little bit more difficult because of the handle, but you will get used to it, I promise you. Okay, down with the legs, up with the legs. 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 Okay? So that, my friend, is four exercises. Uh, these top four. And again, you don't need a kettlebell, you just need anything that's appropriate to your fitness level. Okay? This one here is the granddaddy of them all, and this will work the whole body again. But again, we want good posture. So when you go down and pick up a kettlebell, Push your butt back and sit on your heels. Don't just go forward like that. Looks very weak. Okay, so. Up under the chin, head faces in. Bang, above the head. Down. Swap sides, three or four each side. Keep mixes changing. We will show you side on. Okay, again, good form. So butt back, which gives you a straight back. Bring the kettlebell under your chin, above the head. Come back under the chin. Down, butt back. Three or four, one side, swap. Under your chin, <sighs> exhale as you punch up. Breathe in as you come down to engage your core. <sighs> Reset. <sighs> Again, dumbbell, bang. Okay, my friends, that's Artie's top five exercises. So what I'd like you to do is do three or four reps. Don't worry about doing eight reps, 10 reps, 12 reps. Why stop at 10 reps if you've got more energy and you can go to 12? Why go to 10 reps if you can only do six with good form? So I'm not gonna give you an exact number, how many sets, I want you to work to your level. And probably every couple of days, do it twice a day, morning, afternoon, if you're stuck at home working from home. And then the next session, add some more reps. Okay team, please contact me if you, are, you would like me to personalise a program for you. See you very soon at City Tats. Thanks for your time. Cheers.